Hi, I'm Ken Spector with Happy Cow. We're here in Kiev, Ukraine at Kiev Vegan Boom. This is an event that Happy Cow is co-promoting. And I am here with Anna, Mara, Tanya, and Christina. Say hello. And I was just going to ask them a couple questions about veganism in Kiev, Ukraine. So Anna, how many vegan restaurants are there in Kiev? Just a couple. On Happy Cow, I believe they're listed two pure vegan. The others may serve honey, which isn't considered fully vegan, but we will have to investigate. And what is your favorite vegan restaurant in Kiev? One Planet. One I, Planet. Yeah, I'm completely in love with that, but it has opened just a couple of months ago. And One Planet has a booth over here. I had a vegan burger and some outstanding mushroom soup. Yes, it was a green burger. That's really good. What's in that green burger? Is it spinach? Yeah, sp spinach. Yeah, that yeah. was really good. That was a really good vegan burger. I have to brain dry of a vegan burger. Yeah. <laughs> At One Planet. And uh, Mara, what do you think of the event today? What did you enjoy at the event today and yesterday? This event is something new for me. I uh, never saw how much vegan and vegetarian in Kiev. I didn't know. We have a lot of people who are vegan and we met today and yesterday. I enjoyed too much this. It's an unforgettable atmosphere and new meeting and really tasty yeah. food and something new taste. It's uh, something interesting for me. Tanya, how did you find out about the event here today? The same as we usually find out about all the vegan and vegetarian stuff here. It's social media, especially Facebook. Okay. Yeah, and we also have kind of vegan community here and um, we're focused on uh, activism, protecting animals and promoting vegan lifestyle. Why did you become vegan, Anna? I can't hurt others. No matter who is that, so that's the point. Why did you become vegan, Mara? Vegan accidentally, because my boyfriend is vegan. Vegetarian, I just try it and I like it. Vegan, it's uh, comfortable because my boyfriend cook dishes and I ate it. it. It's comfortable for me and comfortable for him to be vegan couple. And Tanya, why did you become vegan? Um, firstly, it was for health issues. Yes. I found out that all the animal related food is like super unhealthy okay. and I was look, shocked look. because look. no one has ever told me about that they never teach you about this stuff in school or like parents don't know about this okay. so yeah and that's what made me go vegan. Christina can you tell me a little bit about what you think of the event? I think that uh, this event is uh, fascinating and uh, People here I love them because they love animals. I think that uh, such events must be each uh, week, each month, more often. Yes. 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 I agree. Now this is not real leather, is it? No. I hate everything real. I'm against of uh, real fur, real skin, and other natural materials. Yes, I'm really against. This is fake. This is fake, and this is fake. <laughs> really. How long have you been vegan for? Uh, I am vegetarian from the childhood, from uh, nine years, and uh, I tried veganism uh, two months ago. And uh, yes, I really like it, uh, but uh, I'm, it is a big problem in Ukraine because it is not popular, such as such in America or in Europe. So, uh, for example, milk, um, plant milk, uh, it is uh, so uh, it's very rich. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yes, and uh, this is a big problem. But tofu and uh, something. Uh, uh, and uh, vegetables, they are cheap, so we can buy it. Mm -hmm. I believe that in future it will be more easier and uh, people will realize in their soul and in their brain that uh, we can eat delicious food without animal. Thank you all for joining me. Thank I'm Ken so from Happy Cow. We're here in Kiev at Kiev Vegan Boom.
am here with the <laughs> organizer of this amazing event. You should do this, like, the vegan yeah. hooligano. Is that how it's pronounced? Vegano hooligano. Vegano hooligano. His name is Rudolf Krajewski. Krajewski. Yeah. And he is the organizer of the event. Yes, yes. So I actually had contacted this guy about five months ago, and next thing I know, he's creating an event on our behalf, and we're helping to co-promote it. You are an amazing guy. Thank you, thank you. Tell me, what has the highlight been for you on your own event? First, you. Oh, <laughs> and thank you, Eric. Thank you. Uh, really, really. Uh, it's a, it's a, it's a big shifting, big boom. Yeah. So I I believe that today and to yesterday, we really make a big and boom. Yes. Uh, we'll see in the future, uh, I believe. Yes. Uh, let's pray and leave, and we'll see the effect. Yeah. So the, I I uh, heard. Uh, Come on, uh, let's do this uh, soon. Yes. Okay. Yes. And I'm so glad you did this. I found that there were so many people that really didn't know about vegan nutrition. Yeah. There are a lot of non-vegans here and people just trying to learn about veganism. How many people do you think showed up here the last two days? I believe 4,000 people uh, for two days. 4,000 people. Nice. Maybe today three or two and, and half, and yesterday it was like one and a half. Yes. I believe. What was the biggest challenge of creating this event? Money, Money. <laughs> budget, yes. budget, uh, but even budget uh, is still like uh, okay, yeah, <laughs> like that. Yeah. So the still budget, okay. So the, these are expensive. You have so much. You put so much into this event. It's unbelievable. And what I thought was unusual about this vegan event was uh, it went on uh, until 2 a.m. You, you you were planning this event to be a full day and night event. Yeah. Uh, yesterday we finished like a uh, little earlier. Yes. But uh, we collect uh, the power, and yes. tonight we'll have a really good uh, lineup. Yes. Very good DJs. Uh, our friends, uh, vegans, THP. Uh, yeah. uh, they are co uh, co organizers of festival. Thanks for them. We'll have very good lineup. Yeah. So like it's vegan beats uh, yeah. like that. Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. Big party. Well, thank you so much. I really appreciate yeah. it, my friend. You thank have you. been an incredible yeah. inspiration for me because I see it can be done wow. even in countries where I don't even think yes. of veganism as, yeah. as as popular. And you pulled this off brilliantly. Yeah, we did friend. it. You really did. Yeah. So thank you. I'm Ken Spector from Happy Cow. This is Rudolph. This is the man behind Kia Vegan Boom. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.